So the next standard that we're going to work on is sequence of events. Who can tell me what sequencing means? If I were to sequence something, what am I doing to it? Who has an idea of what they might think it may, might mean? Yeah? Okay, so you're on the right track. So when you sequence something, you're putting something in order. So sequence of events is putting things in order or the order of events in a story. So things that help us understand a story like first, second, next, those clue words, and I'm going to write it here. Anytime you see words like this, that is a sequence. So something first, secondly, <coughs> next, um, then, okay? So like Josiah was saying, in a story, there's a beginning. What comes next? Middle. A middle and, and, and an ending. ending. So that is a sequence of events. So the story that we are going to read, and some of you might have heard of it already or have read it, it, there was an old lady who swallowed a frog. Raise your hand if you've read the story before or know of it. Good. So this story is a great example of sequence of events. And we're going to read the story. And we're going to put it from first, second, next, and last.